Hello YouTubers! This time I've tested Sony VTC4, a high-drain lithium-ion battery of 18650 size which supports the charge current up to 40 amps. My testing equipment supports the charge current up to 20 amps, that's why I'm gonna test it at 5, 10, 15 and 20 amps. But first let's take a look at my testing method and my equipment. All the tests were done using a special battery tester, the ZK E-Tech EBC A20, which supports 4-wire measurement, discharge current up to 20 amps, and it can be connected to a PC for building graphs. I've also used version 2.5 of my homemade battery holder. It holds a battery like this, or like this. I've followed all the prescriptions of the IEC 61960 standard concerning battery capacity measurement. The air temperature was 20-25 centigrade, and before each discharging cycle, a battery was charged at its standard charging current mentioned in its datasheet, and after that it was left uh, for one hour minimum. After discharging cycle, it also was left for one hour minimum. I've bought these batteries from Queen Battery, which is my reliable supplier of genuine batteries. They offer individual approach to each customer and special discounts depending on the quantity you buy. I will leave a link to their website and their email under this video. The cell which I've tested has the following marking SE US 18650 VTC4 C4 G 1828842ZB19A. It has the following specs according to its datasheet: nominal capacity 2100 mAh, nominal energy 7.77 Watt hour, minimum capacity 2000 mAh, minimum energy 7.40 Watt hours, nominal voltage 3.7 volts, standard charge current 2 amps. Charge and voltage 4.2 volts, maximum discharge current 30 amps, discharge cutoff voltage 2.5 volts, AC impedance 12 milliohms, average weight 45 grams. The measured weight of my cell is 45.2 grams. Let's take a look at the capacity test results. At 0.2C or 0.40 amps, Sony VTC4 gave out 2194 mAh or 80-69 milliwatt hours. At 5 amp discharge rate, the result was 1999 milliamp hours or 707 milliwatt hours. At 10 amp discharge rate, it gave out 2043 milliamp hours or 6843 milliwatt hours. At 15 amp, 2042 milliamp hours or 6596 milliwatt hours. At 20 amp discharge rate, the result was 1998 milliamp hours or 6084 milliwatt hours. Each test was done three times and the results were not as stable as I'd like them to be, especially at high discharge rates. For example, at 20 amps the difference could reach 350 milliwatt hours, which is not good. So at the end of the day I can say that Sony VTC4 is a great cell which has about 2000 mAh capacity and more than 6000 milliwatt hours energy even at 20 amps. That's all for today, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel and look forward for new reviews.